I'll go box clips. My main advice is to actually follow through and listen to what the videos tell you to do. <laughs> It's, I do not know why I have to state that out loud, but it just feels like a lot of people think that what I'm telling you to do is, is optional and it tends to not work to people's benefit not to. I would literally watch the videos in order as they are laid out and know that you really should not skip through. You should not be picky choosy in the videos. You know, you can pick and choose your strategies if you want, but as far as getting educated through it, people think, oh, I just need to learn one strategy. I'm like, there's a reason why I'm telling you to learn all of them. You need to know, even if you've got your strategies, you need to know if my other strategies are working with you, for you, against you. You really need to know. Even if you're not going to be a J-hook player, you need to know, even like in this scenario right here, like how is this J-hook working out right here? What and how and why you... You need to still know all of the strategies. Learn them all, understand them all, and again, the markets are diverse. They are gonna be throwing you different things each different type of day. It's gonna give you different personalities. You need to have um, a toolbox of tools. Um, I, I used the example the other day, I thought it was a good one, of when you go in your garage, people are like, well, what do I need all these other tools for? What do I need all this stuff for? Why is your garage full of tools? Like. This is to the men in the room here. I mean, maybe ladies who have garages too, but listen, man, I'm just going to call it like it is. Like men, we have all kinds of crap in our garages. Why? Because you don't know when you're going to need that other tool. Yeah, you can fix the majority of things with a hammer and a crowbar. Okay. But what about the day that you need that specialized tool? What if you need the socket set? Um, I tried to put together my kids' um, basketball hoop myself, which was a mistake. I should have just paid somebody to come and do it but uh you know took an entire weekend to do it and then realized i i don't know i got this one tool that solved everything it's a, a bendy neck uh, i don't even know what to call it like it's a it's a tool i've never even seen before I didn't even know it existed but i saw it at lowe's and i'm like uh that looks like that would work made the whole thing so easy it's like a bendy neck socket set but it also has an open hole so you don't have to have the whole socket go over the nut it was crazy I don't even know what to call it. Uh, right tool for right job. House full of tools. Yeah, and I mean, you know, you're gonna you're gonna need that particular tool on that certain day, you know, and you're gonna, you're gonna be glad you had it. Yep, and proper sizing, exactly. Having the wrong size tools, wrong set, you're missing a socket, it's a real, real pain. Yeah, there's no single perfect tool, exactly. You're gonna need that weird Allen wrench that one day. You're gonna need that weird star tool, you know, for that one gadget that needs to get fixed. And there are some principles that still the, still always apply. Like let's, let's think about this. It's always lefty loosey righty tidy though, isn't it? It's a good. This is this analogy is just getting better. <laughs> always lefty loosey righty tidy. So what's the commonality of all of our stuff? We're still wanting to go in the direction of the tide, in the direction of the wave. Mac the ultimate giving us that information across four instruments. So in general, I want all of my tools to apply to this logic. We're going big if it's with this. We're going a little bit smaller if we're going against. Press the like button, share, subscribe, and comment below with your thoughts and what you've learned.